you're finally invited to that party, that party you've always wanted to go to with the popular people. You and your friends, you go. Everyone's drinking, you're drinking, one of your friends passed out. There's that group in the corner that's not doing something completely legal. And then there comes that moment where you're stood in the middle, surrounded by people yet you feel alone. You're not talking to anyone. You look to the beer in your hand and you just think, I don't know these people. What am I genuinely doing with my life? Is this what I want my life to be? Yeah, that was me. You see, I would be the kid who was walking back from school or when I went into work, walking back home with my headphones on, listening to that incredibly depressing music. And as I was walking, I couldn't even look up to the sky or my surroundings. I could only look at the ground at my feet. I don't know why. And when I was listening to that depressing music, coming back from that stressful shift at work, or a little bit before when I was coming back from school, and I just had that thought, what am I doing with my life? I'm so lost. Now, this is going to be a very short video, but that's because I'm going to get right into something that I want you to do right now. I don't wait for me, like literally just pause the video and just, I want you to go grab a piece of paper. I want you to actually do this and take action. If you're not willing to do this, then just click off the video because this won't help you. But if you are genuinely willing to find your purpose your, in your life, to stop feeling so lost. I want you to genuinely go grab a piece of paper and a pen and write down your ideal day. Everything that you have wanted to do all with the ideal good habits. The time that you want to wake up every day, the time you want to go to bed, the things you want to get done, the good habits, your ideal perfect day. Write it all down. Make it realistic, you know, make it actually like doable. Don't make it like, I'm going to wake up at 5 a.m. every single day. You're probably not going to do that. Uh, that. That's hella hard. So make it realistic. Go do that. I genuinely want you to do this. Right? Literally pause the video. It'll make my video look bad. Like the retention won't be as good, but I don't care. Just go do that. Just pause the video. Go write down your ideal day. After you've done that, now I want you to look at this piece of paper. I want you to really look at this piece of paper that you've just written your ideal day look at it which one of this list that you've created which one's your passion something that you really really want to do something that you've always wanted to do how much time have you actually allocated to it it's probably not even an hour this is what i want you to do more of this is what i want you to spend more of your time that good habit you want to become i want to become more physically attractive spend more time at the gym you're only allocating like 30 minutes right now. I want to become more mentally healthy. How much time are you spending mentally? I want to become more mentally healthy. How much time are you actually spending meditating? Learning how to become more grateful, how to improve your mental health. Allocate more time to it. I want to eat better food. Go cook yourself an actual meal instead of junk food, instead of this processed stuff. Look at your passion of this list and that's where I want you to start. The thing you want to do most, that's where I want you to start. You aren't going to find your purpose straight away. I'm sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but that's not going to happen. You're not going to create this list and suddenly everything will be cured overnight. It's not how life works. It's a harsh truth. And I'm sorry to be the one who tells you this, but you aren't going to find your purpose straight away. However, just by starting on that thing you really want to do, that passion on that list, on your ideal day, that's a start. You see, there's something known as the circle theory. A lot of other like really good like self-improvement YouTubers have like shown and talked about this. Um, but basically, your purpose is in this center, a little dot in the center, your true desire, your purpose, your reason to be in life. And there are hundreds of circles surrounding it, hundreds of circles that are surrounding your core desire, your purpose in life. Each ring around it is a passion. It's something that you are influenced and you really want to do. Each time you improve in that certain thing, whether it be going to the gym, eating healthier, getting better at piano, skating, tennis, becoming more mentally healthy, it, it could be anything. But once you improve, that layer, that circle disappears. And then you're at the next passion, the next ring. 
and then you improve that, that ring disappears. As you keep gradually doing this, you will eventually get to the center. Just simply start. Now I want you to look at this ideal day that you've written down. I want you to look at it, and I want you to stick it in your bedroom wall. Somewhere that you will see every single day. What's stopping you from following this ideal day? What's actually stopping you? Your mind's going to create some sort of excuse right now. It's going to look for some reason to not do it. Ignore it. Ignore your brain. Ignore your monkey brain that's telling you, oh no, you can't do that. Why not? Why can't you find a reason to follow this ideal day that you wish to have? What's stopping you? In reality, nothing. Just go do it. Find the time. Make the time. Hopefully this helped you out. And I hope things have been really good. I hope things have been alright. And I'd be really appreciative if you clicked on the video. It's going to pop up in the corner here. Because this video could help you out. And subscribe if you want to see more content like this. Stay consistent and don't give up. Hello. <laughs> okay, come here. Someone from a kiss. Mwah.